Genesis, the first book of the Bible. In here, we see the beginning of all things. In the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. In six days, he created everything that we know. And on the seventh day, he rested. After every one of his creations, he said, it is good. God planted a garden in a place called Eden. We know it as the Garden of Eden. And there he put Adam and Eve to care for the garden and all the animals in it. And there were two trees in that garden. There was the tree of life, which they were allowed to eat from. And then there was the tree of the knowledge of good and evil, which they were not allowed to, to eat from. If they did, they would die. And in the garden, there was a serpent. And that serpent tempted both Eve and Adam to disobey God in eating from the tree of knowledge of good and evil. He said that surely you will not die, but once you eat it, you will become like God, knowing good from evil. And with that very action, they were both expelled from the garden. So Adam and Eve, they were kicked out of the garden. And because of that, they had to work the ground in order to get their food. In the garden, they had everything provided to them. But because they disobeyed God, they had to leave the garden. Now they had two sons, Cain and Abel. Cain watched over the animals while Abel was a harvester. And they both presented gifts to God. But because Abel had a pure motive of heart, God accepted Abel's gift over Cain, which made Cain incredibly jealous of Abel, which, which unfortunately resulted in Cain killing his brother. After the scene of Cain and Abel, the human race began multiplying and became very numerous on the earth. And they did what was evil in their sight. They forgot and rejected God. Uh, so God decided, I'm going to start, I'm going to just destroy this all. Uh, but he found favor in a person called Noah and he instructed Noah to create a ark. And in that ark, he would take two of every kind of animal and additional for those who were suitable for sacrifice. And for the next 40 days and 40 nights, it would rain upon the earth. Water came from the sky above and water came from the ground below. And the entire world was destroyed except for Cain, his family, and all of those animals on the ark. After the 40 days and 40 nights of rain that stopped, water began to recede. They would come back on land and Noah would give a offering to God. God, seeing and receiving the offering in his heart said, would never again destroy the earth in a flood. After some time from the flood in Noah, the people began to multiply once again and started doing what was evil in their sight. There was a man named Nimrod and Nimrod built a massive empire at this time. And he said, let us gather together and let us build us a tower toward heaven, making a name for ourselves. God, seeing this, was displeased. So in order to hamper their efforts, he divided their languages. And because of this, the people had to go in their separate ways according to those languages. <laughs> 